If you guys are looking to buy some of the cheapest tradable Rocket League items, then head to the first link in the description and use code Jakers at checkout for a discount. Just before today's video starts, I just want to say that I have messaged the scammer uh, and that I will uh, be giving some items to him. Uh, but let me know in the comment section whether I should give him items for trying to scam me because uh, I feel kind of bad uh, for t uh, taking trust items off him. And it was quite a long time ago. Let me know in the comments whether he deserves his items back. Um, yeah, I, I don't know, because he, he did try to scam me. I'll probably just make sure that he never uh, tries to duplicate anybody's items ever again, and that he promises that. And once he promises that, I'll, I'll probably just drop him, like, a pair of painted wheels or something like that. Uh, I'll decide. Make sure to let me know whether you want to see that. Uh, I'll probably do it at the start of the, my next video, because he probably won't get back to me by the time this video goes up. I found this guy in an online game, and it was actually pretty funny when he said that he could scam. So take a look at today's video. It's actually uh, pretty hilarious. What's going on, guys? In the past couple of days, I've been thinking to myself what I should do for a video that would be entertaining for you guys. And so I was just looking back at some of my old clips, and I'll actually show you a, a quick look at my um, capture gallery in a second. This clip was from, I think, uh, last year, just before I did YouTube, actually. So I, I wasn't even, uh, had, I didn't even have a YouTube channel at this time, but I actually scammed a scammer. And this isn't clickbait at all. I actually did scam a scammer. And you'll see this in today's video. We're going to be taking a look at some of my older clips and after looking back at these clips I actually realized that at the time I didn't actually know but yeah it, it was a scammer and I actually scammed him and I, I sort of feel bad for it now looking back at it and I'm not I don't really class myself as a scammer but for the fact that he wanted to scam me I just wanted to get him back at the time uh, for wanting to scam me so uh, yeah I, I tried to sc scam him and so yeah, I, I probably will message him back at the, at the end of this video. I'll probably, I don't even know what his gamer tag is. I, I'm just going to have to look over the clips and check that. I'll send him a message and, um, yeah, we'll try and see if we can get him into a training lobby again and see if we'll try and scam me again because this was quite a long time ago. It was about uh, four or five months ago. That's a very long time. And so, yeah, we're going to take a look at a few clips in a second. And it was actually when I jumped into an online game and, yeah, he tried to, he tried to tell me that he could duplicate my items. And so at the time, uh, quite ages ago, I thought that this literally, it made me quite angry. I don't know, I don't know why, but I just don't really like scammers too much. And for the fact that he wanted to duplicate my items, I, I, yeah, and I asked him for trust items, and it's a pretty funny video, I hope you guys enjoy it, so we'll take a look at a few clips, and here we go. So first of all, I, I hopped into a game, and, and this guy said trade, and I have no problem with trading with anybody, but this time I really wanted to just grind games and level up my account, because it was quite long ago, and yeah, I was really ambitious and quite savage at the time, and I said no, no thank you, and he said I can dupe though, so this time I was thinking, hmm, I know duplication glitch doesn't exist, but maybe we'll give this guy a chance and see what he's going to try and pull off, so I said yeah, sure, sort of sarcastically, and he gives quite the ambitious reply of positive. So I just say, okay, trade. And he says, okay. So we're sort of at a point where we've agreed to to trade after the game. And so I ask him, can you duplicate my heat wave? Because that's quite a big thing. My heat wave at the time, I, I think I had a few heat waves, about four. This guy says, yeah. And I said, okay, we, we will see. We'll see. We'll, we'll see what this guy can pull up. And so he says, I can make five at the most. And so I'm thinking, whoa, this guy's pretty talented if you can do that. So I ask him, can you duplicate some of my other stuff first? And he, and he says, yeah, sure, no, no problem. Man. So I knew that it didn't exist, and yeah, I wasn't going to be dumb enough to, to get scammed myself. But he says, I say to him, if you can duplicate, then why, why don't you have great items yourself? And he says, I think, he says, yeah, um... Then why, because I need the items to duplicate, and yeah, so he needs that item in order to be able to duplicate. So I ask him how it works, and so he says that he has a file from his computer, and uh, let's just see what he says. He says then, so I could ask, I say invite, I want to see what this guy is going to try and do, and see what he's going to try and do with his methods and stuff. So he just leaves the party, and apparently he can, he can use a file in his computer to duplicate my item, which is pretty weird. Looking back at it now, we're, we're reacting to this sort of, because it's not a live reaction uh, scene. This did ca happen quite long ago, and all the clips you see uh, right now are muted because the game audio was quite loud, and I didn't want you guys to get deafened by the game sounds of, like, especially Starbase Arc. It's got, like, uh guns in the background that shoot so much and so I joined this guy I was actually talking to my mate in the party at the time I think and um yeah we were just talking about getting some good trades I actually was planning on getting trading my way up to 400 keys which was the time just before pick a pixel and so I put up a, a limited topper and I of course wasn't going to let him uh use my heat wave but I say dupe this I want to see if you can duplicate this first and I think this guy only tries to duplicate items that he already has in his inventory because yeah that's the only really way that he could put two items up for me but this guy's actually really really dumb and you guys need to watch this uh, right now so I said to him give me some trust items and then I think I say later on um 
like something like give me more trust items and then we'll move on to my heat wave because of course i'm not gonna give up my heat wave uh just yet and I wasn't going to give him my heatwave anyways. But he puts up two rare decals. I don't think these are from crates. So they're not too spectacular. But they're still items at the end of the day. And they're much better than this limited topper. So he agrees to uh, putting up some trust items in hope that he can get my heatwave. This guy in, in this video is really, really ambitious for, to get my heatwave. I don't think he has great stuff. I think he's... At this time of... Uh, uh, recording this short clip I think uh, duplication glitch was a huge huge scam at the time because people on communities were saying stuff like uh, please um, does anyone want me to duplicate their stuff and people knew that it was a scam some people did but some people were easy enough to fall for it so there we go we've got four I think four different items not too great items but that we've got that for his uh, lovely uh, for our lovely limited topper, which doesn't sell for on anything at all. So we've already, like, got a few items out of this guy. And so I was ambitious to get a bit more to see what else we could rinse out of him. Because I, I, I didn't want to leave this guy just standing there trying to trying to scam my heatwave. Of course, if someone tried to scam you, then you, you wouldn't just want to let him take your item and run away with it. And so I hop into another trade with this guy. I accept his trade uh, request again. I say, show me the duplicate because I'm, I'm willing to see whether this guy's actually duplicated it. And I knew that in his inventory, he probably had another copy of it. And of course, he's, he's already got that candy cane that I gave to him. And so he puts two up. And then I think he presses accept. I'm not too sure. Yeah, there he goes. But he presses accept. And I, so I say, oh my god. As if like I actually believe that he's, he's duplicated my items. And so... Um, yeah, so let's just see. I'm just reacting to this live as it is right now. Uh, it's loading in, and so yeah, he say he says it's like loading in as if it's actually a file on, on a computer. I I don't believe any of it to be honest. Um, so he says, can I have my stuff too? So um, like so he wants his he wants his stuff back as I think like the trust items that he gave me for duplicating that item, but. I think he he did want to duplicate my heat wave, and so yeah, I, I wasn't going to give his his item back just just yet, and so yeah, I feel like such a scammer, but I'm not actually a scammer. I just, I just did this to troll this guy. I'm going to message him back and see if I can drop him a few items, but I don't want this guy to be scamming and trying to pretend to duplicate items ever again. So I'm just going to make sure that he um does say that he won't duplicate. So he gives me the two items, and I think we hop into another trade. I'm not too sure how many trades we actually do because there's uh probably quite a few. Um, but then this guy says. I think, yeah, okay, that is for the trust, so I whip up a few things, at this time I had the white endo from pick a pixel, uh, four heat waves, a hex, a ton of stuff that I actually bought from pixel, and um, yeah, a lot of this stuff, even the white Kalo, so if you look back into my trading video with pick a pixel, then a lot of this stuff that you're seeing is stuff that I, I got from him, so he's put up a ton more stuff, a ton more rare decals, and rare items, and so I, I'm ready, I'm ready to, um, duplicate some more items and then move i told him that i, I would eventually move on to the uh heat wave <laughs> which is which is a pretty big item so he's, he's put up a ton of stuff and i think he, he's really ambitious thinking he's going to get my heat wave so this is where we're actually reaching the part where i think it's the funny part of the video because i ask him if he can duplicate these wildcat ears just normal not not anything special no painted wildcat ears so i'm not really going to lose too much if he runs away with this item just yet so i asked him for trust uh, so when he does duplicate it, he says I can't duplicate that and so that probably just means that he doesn't have that uh, as a copy in his own inventory And so I think we move on to another item So this guy makes up a random excuse and says that the file won't go through on his computer and there's nothing uh, It's how the file works something like that and he's just making up more lies about his files and stuff about how he how he can use the file on his computer to duplicate the item So I put up a tiara and I'm just waiting to see whether he can duplicate this item Which basically means uh, if he has a, a copy of this tiara in his inventory So he says that also so that tiara as well uh, Wasn't duplicatable it says, it says common and uncommon items don't work and so he's just showing me a quick thing there. I think that was the nutcracker, or whatever it's called. Uh, so showing that that sort of thing, because because of course the common and uncommon items like the rares and stuff, that they're, they're not as uh, they're, they're more rare than what the uncommon these uh, limited items are. And so it's probably mo more likely for him to have more of these uh, limited items in his inventory rather than the rare decals, which not that many people have with, if they've just started off the game, especially this guy, which doesn't look like he has tons of stuff in his inventory. So he says that does, it does work. And so I'm just thinking, well, okay, okay. Because it's orange, which means limited items. So limited items, in his opinion, work on his file, his sort of file thing. Um, 
but common and uncommon items do not work. So rare and very rare items don't work when you try to duplicate them. That, that makes no sense at all, mate. So I basically just end up saying to this guy that I need his trust. I, I need his trust items. And I said, put up all the items that you showed me that you do as trust. And then afterwards, we'll just move on to my hex mystery and my heatwave mystery decal. But first, I need your trust. Uh, I could do my painted endo as well if the file will accept that too. I just went along with his little file stuff and it said it does accept the file. It does. So my white endo, at this time, it was literally as soon as the turbo crate had just come out. And so the white endo was literally worth about 80 keys. I, I paid about 80, 80, 90 keys off Pick a Pixel for it. And so he gives me some rares and, and very rare items. And of course, for a limited, that, that's, that's not worth it at all. So I'm going to give this guy a message in a second. And I know that these trust items weren't the best. They weren't the greatest uh, trust items at all. Uh, but they're, they're still items in the end of the day. And for limited items that I gave him. And he also gave me the duplicated limited item uh, afterwards after he pretends to duplicate it so I actually got my limited back and plus another limited plus all of his rares and very rares so I'm gonna message the guy I'm gonna make sure that he he doesn't scam ever again uh, and try and duplicate people's items but that the time that it did happen is when the duplication glitch was yeah very fresh very new not man, not that many people knew how to uh, stop from being scammed from the duplication glitch because they all thought that it worked and yeah, some people actually could duplicate at the time. It, it worked in a few cases. I don't know how, but there was just a game glitch um, that pe that people were taking advantage of. So um, I'm not a scammer. I'm of course going to message the guy back, make sure that he never scams uh, for duplicating. I give probably give him a few items, uh, maybe like one pe painted wheel or something to make up for all the rares and very rares he lost quite a long time ago. But keep in mind that this was a long, long time ago and people did actually fall for the duplication glitch. So if you've ever been scammed by, I don't know, this guy might have scammed more people and I, I don't know about it. So if you've ever been scammed by this guy or you've been scammed by the duplication glitch, then, then watch out and please let me know. And if you have proof of someone scamming you, then I might do like a, a scamming patrol series where I've seen Picapixel say that he might do it. And so if he does start that, then I probably won't copy him. I'll probably just let him do his own thing and do that series himself. But if you guys want to see that on my channel and want me to expose scammers and like if I ever get scammed myself, I probably won't. Uh, but because I'm quite good with that sort of thing of checking and all the rules and stuff that you need to check. Uh, but if I ever do, then I'll make sure to let you guys know um, and how to make... I could do like a top five, a top five ways to not get scammed and top five scams that you should know video. If you want to see that, then make sure to let me know. But if you've enjoyed today's video, make sure to drop a like. This is the end of today's video, but I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.